Hi guys, it's me, Kelly B. Cassie, and today we're doing a makeup tutorial featuring the Jaclyn Hill palette. So guys, today we're doing a makeup tutorial using the Jaclyn Hill palette, and I just really want to play with this a little bit more because I haven't had a whole lot of time to play with it lately, and I thought I'd film it for you guys. So if you guys want to see how I made this look, then just keep watching. But before we get started, I just wanted to introduce myself to those of you I haven't met yet. Hi, my name is Cassie. It's nice to meet you, and I would love for you to become friends with me on the internet. And how you can do that is by scrolling down and hitting that red subscribe button down below, and make sure you also hit that little notification belly thing so that you get notified every time I make a new video. Also, I have a huge 5,000 subscriber giveaway going on on my channel right now. It ends August 5th, so make sure you get in on that before it is over. I'm giving away a ABH Nicole Guerrero Glow Kit and also a Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. So those are both really fun things to win, so make sure you go check that out. I'll have it linked in the description box and also up here in a Cardi card. And yeah, let's jump right into this makeup tutorial. So guys, I'm going to start by using some scotch tape. I'm going to put that along my eyes. I'm just going to take the tape and put it on my hand just to kind of take off a little bit of the stickiness. And then I'm just going to kind of place it going at an angle, following the line of kind of my lower lash line up towards my face. Okay, I'm going to start with this mustard colored again. I just really like that as a transition shade. I'm keeping that very high in the crease and kind of just blurring it out at the edges, out to that tape. Now I'm gonna go in with this red shade right here just to kind of deepen up that crease. And this I'm having a lot lower in the crease. Now that I'm done with that, I'm gonna take this purple shade right here and apply that to the inner and outer corners of my eye because guess what? We're doing a halo eye today. And then I'm gonna take this pink shade right here and apply that right in the center of my lid. And now I'm taking this little blending brush and some of that purple that we used earlier and just kind of blending that over the top of this halo eye to connect. And now I'm gonna go in this, that blending brush we used earlier and a tiny, tiny bit of that red just to blend out the edges of the purple. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take that tape off. And now I'm taking my little brush and some of this brown taupe color right here and just putting that underneath my lower lash line. And now I'm going back in with just a tiny bit of that red color and putting it on the very outer corner of my lower lash line. And now I'm just going to take a little bit of this lightest shade right here and apply that on my inner corner and also on my brow bone. And that's it for the eye look. I'm going to put on the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back. So guys, this is the finished look. I really hope you like it. I really enjoyed making it for you guys. And if you guys have not yet checked out my 5,000 subscriber giveaway, go ahead and check that out. There's only like 25 days or something like that left. Actually, at this point, there will probably be like 20 days left. So make sure you go check that out before it ends. And if you've not yet subscribed to my channel, make sure you do so. Go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below and also make sure you hit that little notification bell so that you get notified every time I make a new video. And that's pretty much it. I love you guys and I'll see you next time. Bye.